Let's let's do it. Hola! Hello! Welcome back to our channel. We have plates in front of us mm -hmm. because we're yeah. gonna eat with you. This will be like a mix of like eating and just talking and yeah. just seeing what's up and having fun. First of all, hashtag not sponsored. Oh yeah, this is not a sponsored thing. Not like... sponsored. We are just like, we got these and figured we, we would have fun trying it with you. Our staff writers are on vacation and so we were left to our own devices on having to decide what to do for this week's video. And Chris came up with the idea, why don't we try our Van Leeuwen ice cream? Some of them are vegan for you veganers out there. Yeah. And we would just like catch up and talk. So we're not gonna have the full ones cause we have a bunch of flavors we're gonna try through. So yeah, and I don't wanna waste. We don't wanna waste, but thankfully you can refreeze and like. I think we should just open one and have bites okay. in the one. I'm done with that. Seems very exciting to me. It is. Okay, unwrapping. Okay, so this one is brown sugar honeycomb oh, here. Wow. Okay, first of all, lovely presentation. Love the little Van Leeuwen on the stick. It's a good size. Yeah, I love an ice cream bar. These like, aren't overwhelming, you know. I grew up with like, it used to be Haagen-Dazs, I think, when I was a baby, and then Magnums became like, my thing. Is it good? Mmm. Oh, wow. Well, we have to put that back, so you can't be taking big bites like that. Mm-hmm. I mean, unless you eat all of it. I did notice one of these was already gone from the box. I. Well, I may have had one already, yes, but we're, I thought we were doing a taste test, you know? Mm -hmm. That is really good. The chocolate is perfect. I taste a little bit of the brown sugar. Not so much the honey, but wow, it's quite good. It really is good. I'm a fan. Oh my God, that is perfect. So do you know where you were, what you were doing when you ate one of these? Yeah, I was on the couch right over there watching Ozark. Oh, they're from Honeycomb. Kind of reminds me of like your basic sort of like like vanilla y chocolate. The honeycomb is in there, but it's slight. I, I love that. That's really good. Yeah. So you were watching Ozark. Tell us about that. Oh my God. Well, I started watching Ozark because I listened to Smartless and I mentioned that on the last episode, which is a new podcast by Jason Bateman and Will Arnett and Sean Hayes, three people I love. And I was like, let me try Ozark out. It's been subscribed to me forever, but I just never pulled the trigger. So I was like, oh, let's see what happens. And I really have been binging it, like starting it during the day, not waiting till the evening. And I just finished season three, which is all they have so far. There is a reaction video that I posted on my TikTok I because I was, I mean, I was just, I could, I was speechless. Speech, so speechless. You know, a conversation we had right before this actually was, we were communicating to each other. He wanted me to ask him a little more about like the things he's experiencing and what he does and watches. So, watched it right there live where we're getting to know so what, what Ian's experiencing, you yes. know? Let's see what happens when the camera turns off. I'll toss him out the window, <laughs> off, off, of the, off of this floor. So, this is exciting. Another vegan flavor. This is vanilla wild berry swirl. Okay. Vanilla wild berry squirrel. Okay. Made with oat milk. And we stand oat milk in this house. Yeah. Can I see the, the packaging? Cool. So it's like same outdoor moment and then indoor moment is giving like if you took once again a strawberry chocolate. kind of cheesecake vibe almost. It's like the swirl in Let's there. Let's see if it perfectly replicates. Oh. So it's definitely not as yellow. Oh, that is white. I'm interested because I don't love a fruity flavor with my chocolate mm, stuff, mm. but I don't mind that. Oh, I love that actually. It's a great little hint of berry. Oh, wow. I am a strawberry, like a fruity kind of person when it comes to ice cream sometimes. You like fruit for like dessert. I like fruit for like dessert. Taking frozen strawberries and some yogurt and like making a, a fake ice cream, but just with berries or blueberries. I'm so curious about the coconut water thing. Right, are you a coconut water fan? Again, asking about him, you know? Yes, <laughs> I love coconut water. I haven't had some in a, in a long time. Ooh, oh, this one I'm excited about. So this one is not vegan, but it looks very good. 
And we are not vegan, so we consume all toffee brown sugar. Ooh, that's really up your alley. That's very up my alley. Are you, you're, you're not a toffee person, are you? I'm not like, you know, I'm more of a Nutella, hazelnut, Love a chocolate. Nutella moment. I love a Nutella. I don't see him like veg out or like really get into like a sweet very often. But if you put in like a, a tub of Nutella in front of him, that's the one thing where you'll lose yourself in it. Oh, yeah. You'll pull a me and just eat until like you can't eat anymore, which yeah. is what I do every day. If any of you have had Nutella, you understand what I'm talking about. Yeah, I mean, I, I get it for sure. The texture. Yeah, there's some crunchiness on the outside. What's, I think that is the toffee, one? I'm guessing. Oh, okay. Okay, I have a feeling I'm gonna like this. I mean, already. What are the notes we're getting? Hints of what? So this crunchy stuff on the outside is toffee. I don't know if I sense brown sugar in the ice cream. It's a little vanilla for me, mm. but the toffee being around it makes it for me. Okay. What do you think? You're not going crazy over it. Because for me and toffee and I- You have a weird relationship. Like it's just it's like us. so, yeah. It's too sugary. Like I appreciate the look and then I want it to be more of like either a graham cracker or like almond crunchies. But because it turns into the sugar, I like feel it like sit on my teeth. It's such a weird way to explain it. It's like, oh, now that's the toffee. Now it's sugar. It's like I, one bite of the toffee thing and I'm good. Your sweet is chocolate or Nutella. He's not like a nerd's rope like- Ooh. Sugary, uh, what's that called? Sour? Tandy. Tandy. Coffee is kind of like on the line. It's getting towards just being straight sugar. Yeah. So I think that's where your cutoff is. I would say this so far is probably one of my favorites. Oh, that's okay. what I'm gonna be reaching for. So I far. already have a bit of a stomach ache. So I'm gonna probably, I, I think I'm gonna pause from, so I'm gonna watch you and I'm gonna comment and I'm gonna be your interrogator. You've had three bites? I know, but I'm telling you, the sugar of all that. You are crazy. Yeah, you're crazy. Yeah, I know. <laughs> are you really gonna tap out for raspberry cheesecake? I am. Okay. I am. I thought that was gonna be the one to get him, but it's okay. I'm here and I bet most of you enjoys sugar and candy and stuff. You know, you're you're an odd one out. Yeah. Without the I candy. do, I do. I'm just like I'm already full and I just know my two hours in the future matter more to me than trying this, which I'll be able to try it later. Right. I am low-key lactose intolerant, so I'm sure I yeah, will be you shouldn't be doing this either. Yeah, but as we all know, lactose yeah, intolerant but... people do not care about their time on the toilet afterwards, you know? Oh, it's it's always worth it. Anyway. No, Brazo, it's gonna have a sort of like tart vibe, I'm sure. Actually, let me not tell you, how about you just tell us? And what's on the outside? It's just something crunchy. It's not something I hate. It's not something I'll reach for. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> I'm putting it back. If this was all that was left at an ice cream party, I would eat it. Vanilla caramel swirl. That one I've tried. Oh, French ice cream. Really this looks very good to me. I feel like we should also talk about this past week. Oh. We didn't film too many videos. And I just want to say, sometimes for mental health, you really need a break. Yeah. Before TikTok, I took my fair share of breaks from social media because sometimes it really gets to be too much. And then I think when it becomes your job, you feel more of an obligation to not take a break. Then you have to remember, you always have to put yourself first. A little bland for me. Oh, okay. Maybe I didn't get any caramel. I don't think I found caramel in there the, the same way as well. The, right. It was dark. I was binge eating watching Ozark. I really wasn't paying attention to the caramel swirls in there. Okay, next. Triple chocolate swirl. Another vegan flavor, which we love. So this is crunchy, crunchy, crunchy. Ooh. Little chocolate things on the outside. Oh, wow. Non-dairy, let's see. Mm. I, I like have more of a stomach ache just watching you keep eating. How can you keep eating that? It's just it's baked with oat milk, but I taste coconut. Oh. Cause there's coconut cream and coconut oil. Ooh, interesting. And it's very Do good. Do you like that or mm -hmm. is it not the vibe? I think I like the outer shell with the chocolate crunchy things and the chocolate dip. The ice cream is very good. Yeah. Again, if it were a tub of ice cream, I wouldn't be reaching for this one. My favorite is they're like, man, I don't know. Takes a second bite. <laughs> Why are you taking a second bite? A big bite, by the way. I love sugar. Are you gonna finish it? I'm gonna take another bite for sure. Okay. Maybe I, I might revisit some of the ones that I was really into, you know? Mm -hmm. Nice. So what's been the most exciting part about your week? Um, 
I don't know. My day to day, just like waking up and like. We both got vaccinated. Oh yeah. Oh my God, I got vaccinated on Tuesday. I got my hey, first. Hey, hey. Got my first vice, Pfizer. Pfizer. You got your first shot. I got my first shot of Pfizer, but you got the one Johnson. I got Johnson, Johnson and Johnson, Johnson. So I got one shot and done. I think Johnson and Johnson is around 80%, but it protects against a lot of other Hilarious. viruses. I'm still only hanging out with like the three to four people that I always see. And I, as we know, have no friends. Not no, true. I have my best friend, Tyler Joseph Ellis. Check out his TikTok, he's amazing. I am, now that I'm a little vaccinated, trying to make a few more friends. A few times it has gone terribly. A few times isn't the one time I tried. So we're going back out there. I'm hitting the pavement and I will, I will make friends. I know I will. Yeah. Um, you also burned yourself. Oh yeah, I was I was making sweet potatoes and Brussels sprouts and I burn myself, as you do. Thank you for watching this week's video. Stick around for the bloopers and remember to focus on your blooming. blooming. We love you. Bye bye. Oh, I'm just gonna, oh, okay. Yep. That's what I'm here for. <laughs> but I would say this is, before I walk away. I'm not allergic. My body just doesn't agree. But Thank God. Thank God. <laughs> I know. I was just clowning you. Anyway, I wouldn't go for it. Okay. No, no offense, girl. No offense. I love you and you're so beautiful. Before I was even like big, before TikTok even happened, I took a few breaks. Before from, I was famous. I said big and I was like, shut up, you're not big. If anyone out there ever feels pressure to like deliver, regardless of what, it's because I'm getting too like. You get, you, you get a little preachy. I just want to like give everyone a hug with my words sometimes. Totally, totally, totally. Yeah. God, chocolate. Lick it. Mm, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. You got it? No. That's the thumbnail right there. Yeah, that's the <laughs> thumbnail for sure. That's going to melt if it doesn't go back. But here, we can just do this. Um, you got vaccinated. I like pull, pulled out a sheet, a pan, a baking tray. Yeah. And ah! Yeah. That was a, an exact, you just saw <laughs> me go into a, an exact recreation of exactly what happened that day. Oh, um, my buttons is on buttons. You whore. Dirty, dirty boy. Oh my God. Um, on camera. Rawr. I got you, moonlight. You're my starlight, I need you all night. Come on, dance with me. I'm levitating. Yeah, there you go. Yeah.